Hi, this is Heather with Keep It Simple Social Media. And in this quick video, I want to show you how to simply make a post on your Facebook business page and also add it to your Instagram account. That's provided you've already gone through the steps to add your Instagram account and your Facebook business page together. So let's just look at where we're at. We're on the wall of our business page. The first thing that I need to do is I need to make sure that I'm actually on the business page and not my personal account. And I can see by looking up in the top right hand corner that I am on this business page account as well as if I was to look under here you could see I would be commenting as the business page um, Susan McGugan. So I know I'm on the business page and I am now ready to create my post. What I need to do is I need to click on the professional dashboard on the left hand side right here this tab. I just click on it and it gives me a drop down menu and what I'm really looking for is my platform tools one of which is the meta business suite. I want to be creating my content today in the meta business suite so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on meta business suite. Now it is from here that I want to go ahead and click create a post right here in the center. I want to create this post. I go ahead and I click it and now it opens up my building creator studio. Let's call it where I can create my post. I'm going to watch it get created over here in the middle and I'm going to create it on the left hand side. But the first thing I want to do as I had mentioned is I want to also post it to Instagram. So I need to click this little drop down arrow and once again Again, I want to remind you that there are a lot of little arrows or diamonds and things that you need to actually click in order to see what's hidden behind that little drop down menu. So let's go ahead and click it and sure enough there we have our Instagram account and if I want to create this post on both Facebook and Instagram I need to check the box and then what I want you to do is I want you to take your cursor outside of the box and just give your pad a little click and that menu will disappear because if you don't click it you won't be able to see how to add your media and we want to click add a photo you need to know where the photo is in this case it is on my desktop and I created a hello January post we click open and automatically it loads the photo and it's ready to be published however I have not created my content. So where it says text, I want to drop or write whatever text it is that I plan on posting. And I am going to add some personal notes to this. Okay, so we've written our text in. We've got a couple of little calls to action in place. We want to go ahead and click on the little upside down teardrop, which is our location. We click here and we enter our location. And in this case, this is Nanaimo and we save. And now what I want to do is I want this post to actually go out tomorrow. So I want to click on the word schedule right here. Now the only place you can schedule a post is either on your phone, on your mobile, or here in the business suite um, because you cannot just create a post on your wall and schedule it. It does not allow you to do that any longer. So we're going to click schedule post. You're going to choose when you want that post to go out. In this case, it's going to be tomorrow morning and we want to make sure we change the time and then make sure you do the same thing over on Instagram. Notice I'm switching it from PM to AM and the time is going to be 6.30. We can just do that. And then what we do is we go ahead and we click on schedule the post. Now you can go into Instagram once the post is scheduled and you can add your hashtags. So for me, in this case, I'm going to go down and I'm going to grab my hashtags. I keep them in my notes on my desktop computer. 
copied your hashtags from your notes or wherever you keep them, you notice up here where it says this is scheduled to go out. We want to go ahead and click on this post. It will open in a preview. There's three little dots over here. So remember I talked about the half diamonds, the dots are the other thing that you want to watch for. Let's go ahead and click it. Here we have edit post. We're going to go into the post which is scheduled for Instagram. We're going to add our hashtags, our call to actions as you can see, and then we are going to go ahead and save that post. And now it will go on to Instagram with the hashtags, but not on Facebook. Facebook with the hashtags because in actual fact you want to bury your hashtags if you're using them on Facebook because if the consumer clicks on them it will take them away from your business page to where, wherever all those hashtags are on Facebook. So that's why we don't necessarily use as many hashtags or any hashtags on Facebook. So there's an example of how we schedule our posts to go out on your Facebook business page but also your Instagram account now in 2023. Remember everyone, let's keep it simple.